Building a landing page. Social media giants would like you to believe that they are the alpha and omega of online presence. Yes, that is a big part of your online activity, but when it comes to selling a product or service as a viable business, you want to have your own website. As we discussed before, you don't want to be at the mercy of the hundreds of algorithm changes of the likes of Facebook and Twitter. When it comes to online marketing, you can and must use email lists to drive visitors out of their inbox and into specific action. That action happens on a landing page. Fortunately, today, there are a lot of builder tools like Visual Editor and Optimize Press that can help you get there. Some of the best landing pages can be up and running pretty quickly if you use these tools. Unbounce is a tool that can help you create a landing page that helps you with the conversion rate and tries to reduce the bounce rate. It's a simple tool which mostly requires you to use drag and drop options. Also, remember that a lot of people use their phones to navigate the web. So, make sure that you create response elements that help with the conversion rate. Because if your page does not load effectively in its mobile version, you will see a lot of bounces instead of conversion. Then, you need to add in forms to your page. This helps you get the data you need from your subscribers. A lot of landing pages are meant to get user data, like email IDs. If you have a cumbersome form, you will once again notice bounces instead of conversions. That happens if you ask for too many details. No one likes to sit and fill out forms. Let's talk about the structure of your landing page now. This isn't very complicated. You need a primary header that announces the goal of the page. A line right under it serves as an advertising tagline. You can either make it a punchline or give out actual information in a snappy fashion. Add an image under it. And remember that this image will be the face of your page. Then comes the first section. If you choose to split the page into two, then the left side of the page should be a paragraph with more information about your product or service. It's what the visitor has come to you for. Under that, you want to add a section which tells them the benefits of signing up for your email list. Make it good, because this might define the chances of your conversion rate. The right side of the page will be a short form where the visitor is prompted to enter their personal details, like their email address. Once you have the page, you need to start thinking about driving traffic to it. That's our next move. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.